Hello and welcome to another one of my lead code videos. In this one, we'll do lead code 383 ransom note, which basically says you're given a ransom note and a magazine, and we want to know if the ransom note can be fully constructed using the letters from magazine. And each letter in magazine can only be used once, right? So in this case, A, B, um, the ransom note has A, the magazine doesn't. So we can't use it in this case the magazine only has one a and one b and here we need two a's so we can't construct it from the magazine and in this case there are two a's and the magazine has two a's and one b and so we can construct the ransom note because there are two a's available in the magazine so the approach we're going to take is we're going to just build a, a frequency map of letter to frequency of the magazine and then and then iterate through ransom note and try to pick out the letter from the that frequency map and then decrement the frequency right so if we reach a point where we can't pick a letter from the that map then we know that we can't construct the ransom note so let's try and code it and see how that looks like so first we we'll have a frequency map i'll go ahead and type that out so this is the magazine frequency map. This is basically a map of character to integer, which represents how many times it occurs in the map. And then we iterate through each letter in magazine. And then for each letter, we want to put it in the map. So, so here I have, you know, we put the character as the key. And for the value, if, if it already exists in the map, then we get that count otherwise we default to zero and then we increment one to the existing count right so this is the existing count where we get it from the map and if it doesn't exist we default to zero and then we add one and so this will give us our frequency count map and so the next step now is to iterate through the characters in the ransom note let me go ahead and do that real quick okay so we have a loop that iterates through ransom note and then what we want to do is if we find, if we don't find the character in the frequency map, we simply return zero. Sorry, I meant return false. So here we go. If the, if the character is not in the map, we return false. Otherwise we know that it is in the map. And so we have to decrement the frequency. So we'll compute our new frequency. So this will be our new frequencies. We'll basically get the frequency from the map and decrement it by one. So now if we find that our new frequency is zero, we want to just remove that from the map. Otherwise we put the updated frequency into the map. So here it is. If our new frequency is zero, we simply remove the character from the map. Otherwise we update the character count to the new frequency. And so at the end of this loop, if, if it finished successfully, we know that ran everything in ransom node can be constructed. You know, if, if we run out of characters, we'll eventually hit this condition and we'll return false. That means at the end, if this loop finishes, we return true. So let's see how that does. Cool, all test cases passed, we can submit. Perfect, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.